Pee Wee, keep your eye on the money. Oh yes, keep your eye on the dealer's hand. Welcome fellow KISS fans, welcome to It's All For You Demons, celebrating the fun of being a KISS fan. Welcome to the weekend and how we are celebrating the fun of being a KISS fan tonight is we are talking one of my favorite albums of all time, 1985's Theater of Pain. And how are we celebrating the fun of being a KISS fan with a Motley Crue record is we are taking tracks from Theater of Pain and just having a little imaginary fun with those tracks and wondering where they would fit in on one of the biggest Kiss albums in the catalog, 1982's Creatures of the Night. That's right, it is Theater of the Night. Tonight in the Wax Night basement, let's have some fun. Christmas, 1985, I got Theater of Pain and Duran Duran Arena on cassette and really changed my life. This album led me down the primrose path, if you will, to these guys because I fell in love with theatrical rock. So this album is hugely important to me, huge soft spot, my favorite Motley Crue record. Not the best. The best, of course, is Shout at the Devil, but I rank theater number one for sentimental reasons alone. And today I was waxing Theater of Pain and thought, what tracks from this record could Kiss pull off and what album would it be on? And I immediately thought Creatures of the Night. So that's our task tonight. We're gonna wax what tracks from Theater of Pain would go best on Creatures of the Night. And we are doing this very simply. Each track is either going to receive a pass or it will receive Boom! So in our competition of Theater of the Night, tonight we start with track number one, City Boy Blues. And to me, City Boy Blues, performed by Kiss on the Creatures of the Night record. Track number one is going to be a hard pass. <laughs> to me, City Boy Blues is just too bluesy for Kiss. But to me, City Boy Blues is not a Kiss song. It's a perfect Motley Crue song. Next up, Smoking in the Boys Room. We're gonna have another pass. Two passes right out of the gate. And the reason is, Smoking in the Boys Room, I'm not a fan of that song at all. I would not want to hear it by Kiss on Creatures of the Night. I don't ever really want to hear it by Motley Crue again. Next up, Louder Than Hell. And here we go with our first, boom. To me, Louder Than Hell is I Love It Loud's little brother. The demo for Louder Than Hell was originally called Hotter Than Hell. So there had to be some maybe borrowing from the Kiss catalog just a smidge. Now this one is hard because Louder Than Hell was one of the songs that moved me as an 11 year old. So this one is a no brainer. Louder Than Hell could have been done on Creatures of the Night, and how awesome would Eric Carr's drumming have been on this song? The sound of Creatures of the Night, drum-wise, would be amazing on Louder Than Hell. Now, as a huge fan, Theater of Pain, a question arose in my brain that I had to ask the rest of the Wax Night crew. What track do you like better, Louder Than Hell, or I love it loud. And honestly, I can't decide. We're gonna have to come back to this. That's gonna be a topic for the end of this vlog. Louder than hell, or I love it loud. And our next track, keep your eye on the money. And that is a boom. 
Keep Your Eye on the Money is a total Ace song. Let's just pretend Ace recorded on Creatures of the Night. How perfect of an Ace song would this have been? Ace could have pulled off the sleaze, the cockiness, the beauty of this track. This track is a perfect Ace Freely song and would have gone perfect on Creatures of the Night, sung by Ace Freely in a perfect world where Ace Freely played and sang on this record. Our next track, Home Sweet Home, and that is going to be a pass. To me, Home Sweet Home can be done by no one else except Motley Crue, can be sung by no one else except Vince Neil. Sorry, Kiss. Home Sweet Home belongs to Motley Crue. Next track, Tonight We Need a Lover is a mean Gene song. And I'm not talking this guy. I am talking a mean Gene Simmons sex song. Tonight We Need a Lover would have been perfect on Creatures of the Night, sung by a very mean demon in a sexual sort of crazy nights lyric way. This song would have gone perfect on Creatures of the Night. Next track, Use It or Lose It, and it is another boom. Use It or Lose It. Listen to that song and imagine Eric Carr. I would have killed to hear a 1982 kiss do Use It or Lose It and have Eric Carr lose his mind behind that drum kit. Use It or Lose It is another one of those perfect songs. Kind of like Tonight is a perfect Gene song. Use It or Lose It is a perfect Eric Carr song. Save Our Souls, another boom. A perfect gloomy sort of Sabbathy doom Gene song. Save Our Souls, God of Thunder. Raise your hands to rock. This is going to be a hard pass. And the reason I feel could be the acoustic guitars. It almost feels Raise Your Hands to Rock is like a Hot in the Shade era Paul song. Not for Creatures of the Night. So I, I had to give it a pass more for the Hot in the Shade era. And lastly, Fight for Your Rights. That is another boom. And that goes for another Ace song. Just pretend Ace sang and played on Creatures of the Night. Fight for Your Rights is a perfect Ace song. I can picture him doing that thumbs up during the chorus. And just that sleazy slide guitar. That is so Ace Freely. So Fight for Your Rights, boom, for Mr. Ace. And now back to the question of the hour, and that is Louder Than Hell, or I Love It Loud. And it pains me to say this, and it pains me as a KISS fan. But I'm gonna have to go with Louder Than Hell. Mick Mars' guitar is like a bullet. And when I was 11 years old, that bullet hit me straight in the heart. It still hits me every time I hear this song. I am in full-on metal mode. Same thing with I Love It Loud. Totally love that song. The drums, the verses, the chorus, the chanting, it's all great. But to me, just pure on pre-teen heavy metal angst. It's louder than hell by a hair. By a tiny, tiny, large Marge hair. Thank you for hanging with us tonight in the Wax Night basement. Thank you for waxing rock and roll. Nostalgia with us here if you'd like to be a pen pal. Details below. We'll send you some large Marge. Pee-wee. Swag, be good to your babies. Spay, neuter, microchip, never stop dreaming. We will talk to you soon. <laughs>